you know, coming up without my father in my life as a kid, uh, I felt very strongly that if I was going to have a kid that I made, I need to be a part of his or her life. And the only way at that time, I thought you had to be married. Uh, fast forward to what I know now, uh, there's so many financial pitfalls in marriage and divorce that I feel that is a, a negative way of not looking at it if you don't look at it as a business. Because when you think about it, when you get married, and I'm not talking about the church and the covenant, I'm talking about getting married and having documentation. You got to have papers. Those papers are actually a contract. When you start a business, you start with papers. When you dissolve a business, mm -hmm. you're supposed to have papers to dissolve that, or there could be problems with your partner. And I really think before people get married, um, again, I'm a strong proponent for marriage. They really need to have the conversation, not just between them two. I think they should even go as far as to talking with somebody, a counselor. I know some uh, churches have that where you have to go through so much counseling before you get married. But I think it should be taken on that level. And if you're not ready to do that or if you're not ready to do a prenup, then maybe you're not really ready for the marriage. And that, right. that's again, that's that's just me.